Meantime, new details revealed during jury selection this week are giving us an idea of some of the arguments the prosecution and the defense plan to make. Yesterday, we learned that a piece of hair found in Abby's hand when her body was discovered was not a match for Richard Allen. The defense says prosecutors don't have any DNA and no fingerprints, but prosecutors say Allen confessed to killing Abby and Libby, but the defense says that was a false confession. They, they say that it was made when Allen was suffering from a mental health crisis. Prosecutors also say an unspent bullet found between the girls' bodies links Allen to the murder. Court records show a gun matching the unfired bullet was found at Allen's home, but defense attorneys call the interpretation of this evidence a bunch of bunk. Opening statements get underway Friday. We will be there and we'll bring you updates as they become available. For now, you can visit our website, fox59.com, for all of our extensive coverage on this case. Well, turn out